So I've been hearing. I've been hearing where the raw the street is, bro. Y'all want to get rid of the metric glitch builds for 2K23? <sighs> I. Y'all want to get rid of my build? Y'all see the videos? Y'all saying? No more metric glitch builds for 2K23. That's been going on around a lot. You know, when it comes to just the build system, a lot of people have been saying, yo, the metric glitch builds gotta go. And if you don't know what metric glitch builds is, there was a certain glitch where you can make your 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 player taller and have better stats. That's all it is. You know what I'm saying? He could, it was only mainly on next gen, but it was the it was one of the best glitches, bro. If you actually made a metric glitched build, you would understand how fun it was to play with one, bro. Playing with one glitch build is it's amazing, especially at the like the height of 6'9. So here I am. I think we're both metric glitched. I ain't gonna lie. He's tall as hell too. Basically, I am a two-way finisher. I'm 6'9. I'm a two-way finisher. Let me show you the stats real quick. So these are the stats. I'm 6'9 with an 89 perimeter defense, a 86 steal, a 90 block of 81 offensive and 87 defensive rebound with an 82 three-pointer. And that's just because of the little sleeves I put on, you know what I'm saying? With a 92 driving duck. And my driving layup goes to in the 80s. Of course, I need my last overall to get the 99, which is coming soon. Just don't chill. It's coming soon. But yes. Look at the ball control and the speed with ball. The 6'9 is crazy, right? So this build will be able to play center and point guard, as we know. People been wanting to get this out the game. <sighs> I feel it. I can't, I can't, as a content creator and as someone who would not want to go against a build like this, I understand, bro. I understand. But they're just so fun. I feel like the stats don't go up that much to where it gets overpowered in a way. You know what I'm saying? Of course, yeah, he's 6'9 and he could dribble, but he's still a shooting guard, fellas. He's a sh I made him a shooting guard. It's a shooting guard build. So if he's still a guard at the end of the day, he should be able to have some speed. So this game, I actually had my meter on by accident. I'm not a bot. I don't be, I'm, I don't be out here using the meter. It was on by accident. But I was like, all right, fuck it. We're just going to use the damn meter this game. Just because this gameplay was so good. So, basically, the 2K22 build system, it, it has its flaws, alright? We got the glitch builds. We got, bro, we got, um, what I say is always a problem. You having to spend seven badge points for one Hall of Fame badge. That's a problem. So, the 2K22, you know, uh, build system has its flaws, bro. And I ain't gonna lie. Do the, the glitch builds, do they need to go? Look, all I'm gonna say is, fellas, if I could make the same build, right? If I knew about the metric glitch build for my 6-6 build or my 6-5, it would have been pretty much over. So what I'm saying, if I would have known about it earlier, my center would have had this build. And I would have been playing on my guard. And my center has this build. And he, oh my god, that's crazy. That's crazy. You guys don't want to see that. You guys wouldn't want to see that. So I'm like, okay. It could potentially be a problem. Yes. I agree it should be taken out the game for 2k23 I don't understand how is that a thing like the metric and all that like metric is probably the best way to make your bills I didn't even believe in metric I didn't even know about metric until the beginning of this year I was just using the Imperial system so I wasn't able to do my to make my 6-5 guard as a metric build he was an Imperial system build and I, I would have made a metric honestly he would have got probably a, a little bit better stats because I would have probably made him like six five and a half or something. Got a little bit more height with the same stats, you know what I'm saying? But metric is the best way to make your builds. And in 2K23, I don't think they should take out metric system. I think they should go full on on the metric system, fellas. Just get rid of the imperial system because the metric system is the best way. You know what I'm saying? You could really make your, your player like six four and three quarters, six four and a half. You know what I'm saying? It creates more diverse builds. Everybody will not be the same height. Nobody will be the same height. You know, you have 6'5", but he might be like a half inch taller or something. You know what I'm saying? It, it is what it is. Or you have 6'6", six, six on the border to 6'7", but at 6'6", six, six, you still get the bit, like the crazier stats. So you go with that 6'6", six, six and like, like three, four quarters. 
if that makes sense. Yeah. All I'm gonna say is I, I love this build, bro. I love this build. Look at the defense on this build. This guy, he's trying to just just spam his way to the paint. I get it, you know what I'm saying? Every, look at how everybody plays nowadays. On the 1v1 court, everybody plays the same. Everybody has like a tall build who can dribble. You know what I'm saying? Like, I swear I haven't seen these many builds until I made my build. I'm not saying I made it. I, bro, I, I am far away from making, you know, discovering builds like this, bro. Everybody knows about this, bro. I was just wanting to make mine, you know what I'm saying? Just to show you how nice I could be with it, bro. If I was on a 6'9", like like a guard, bro, I'd be nice, like I said. And I have to make an updated version of this build because last video I made on it, you know, he had the 90 uh, driving dunk, but I upped it to a 92, so he has a 92 now. A 92 driving dunk, just so I can get the elite contact dunks. And I have a, I had to give up some, like, my standing dunk. I, yeah, I had to give up my standing dunk, so I can't stand and dunk anymore. So now it's just I'm using uh, fast twitch and all that. You know what I'm saying? And he'll just hope the layup goes in. So no more standing dunks, no standing dunks, just driving dunks. So you see I got that uh posterizer right there. I'm trying to be I let I let him get that. I let him get that. You know what I'm saying? He got that. He got that. Definitely. I'm alright, hold on. I gotta get to the rim. Because honestly, when you're going against builds like this 1v1, it's gonna be hard to shoot on them, bro. Like, when you're going against guards, it's pretty much a GG every single time. Unless, you know, say, because this build has, you could post somebody up with this build, especially guards. You could bring them down low, just dunk on them, or step back, shoot, because they think you're going to drive on them. You could, you could abuse guards with this. And he has the 89 perimeter defense, so you can low, low key try to lock up some guards yourself if you just got it in you like that. Like I said, I got my sleeve, so I can get a 90 perimeter defense if I want. You know what I'm saying? I can get a 90 perimeter defense with this build, bro, fellas, if I want to. Do I want to take it that much unfair? Yes, I do. What y'all was going to say? No. I want to, I, bro, I want to make it as unfair as possible. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to have to take a hit on my three-point shooting to an 81. But I feel like one, you know, one is, it, it ain't going to hurt, you know what I'm saying? But I heard Mike Wang say at the beginning of the year, you unlock new defensive animations once you hit the, a certain thresh mark. A 70 perimeter defense. Oh my god, I'm coughing. 80 perimeter defense and 90. So I, I kind of want the 90, fellas. If I want the 90, I'm going to go on the stage with the 90 and I'm going to go crazy. And he's almost a 99 overall. So it's finna be good for business. Oh my god. So look, it's 17 right, 17 right here. We both got the same builds, I feel. These are the same builds. Look at this. Ugh. Yeah, I can't jump it again. Get the little layup. Cool. 19 to 17. I already know he's probably gonna want to do the same thing I'm doing. He's gonna drive to the paint. Look at how we all play. You know what I'm saying? Look, 1v1, you have to get to that paint, bro. You have to you have to use your size and your advantage because once you get to that paint and you trying to dunk, bro, you can dunk. You're gonna be able to dunk on everybody. You're a big boy. Look at that. He's backing me down. Look at this. Look, alright, I'm not doing this. I'm not over here forcing myself in the paint like this. Of course I'm gonna get to the paint using some fucking moves but this guy just he just dribbling to the paint and you know he just posted me up look at this okay uh trying to hit with some moves i might have to pull up right there bro but i really wasn't trying to shoot because i could do that because i could do that bro i could do I, i'm just saying yo i'm gonna go up and i'm gonna dunk on him the six nine he's not going to win this game bro he lost he's not going to win this game so i'm like all right that's when i'm playing guard you feel what I'm saying? Now, I said, yo, this build could play center. So I'm at the park right here with my man Pharaoh and another old head guy. You can tell he's an old head because look, look at him. Like, look at him, bro. He's a, He got a bald head. One thing you could tell about old heads in this damn game, bro, they going to have that bald head and they going to have that Crenshaw hoodie. Definitely old head material right there. Just bottom. Just bottom. So right here I'm playing center let's just say I'm playing center bro I'm a shooting guard and I'm playing center it is what it is all right so let's start so he's gonna throw up that shot you see I'm snagging the rebound I'm, I'm already going down I'm already trying to get to the paint bro easy layup look at that and it misses 2k it's 2k all right 2k I'm 6'9 I understand I don't wait yeah I don't got no driving layup I can't even be mad fellas I don't have any driving layup I don't have a driving layup right now, but look, once I get 99, it's good. That's going to go in. I hated that thing going. Let me get another board. Let me, let me get, let me get another board, bro. Like I said, I'm getting every single board. Half step, uh, half step. Ooh, look at the look. Ah, ah. 
Look at that. Yes, sir. A little, little hop step late. Okay. Okay, now he's just trying to ice on me, bro. Like I said, bro, an 89 primitive. What are you doing? I love how people think they you they just got you. When you do that little when they pretend to drive, but then they do the little uh step back to the three-point line and then you just pull like, oh, I know I know I'm gonna get hit with this build. I'm gonna just pull. I know I'm gonna get hit with this move. No, bro, you didn't get me, bro. That weak ass move that everybody knows, bro. It is July. It is July. You're not getting people with that move. Honestly, it could still work, let's just say, but you're not getting me with that move. Let's just say that. Another, look at, another rebound. Come here, give me that. I'm just, I pretty much just think I know how to rebound. This build can rebound, like you see, 87 defensive rebound. But I think that's just me knowing how to rebound and just the spaces or the spots where to be. That's mainly it, fellas, because honestly, and you see I have an 80 vertical, right? I have an 80 vertical and hustle on silver. So I'm just going to just... Be a better just big man, bro. I'm just better. I just gotta be that one dominant big man. I'm just that one dominant stat snag machine. You look at him again, she, bro. It's red, bro. Stop it. Let me get that board again. I'm I'm contesting people on the perimeter, then going to the paint and getting the board. That's crazy. That's some Giannis shit. Bro. I promise you, that is some Giannis shit right there, bro. Y'all y'all understand that how crazy that is. To contest somebody on perimeter, then hustle back and get the board. That's that's kind of disrespectful in a way. Imagine someone to be like contested you, 100% smothered, and then got the board. You know what I'm saying? Just don't even need no teammates. Like I'm gonna lock you up and get your board. That's kind of crazy if you ask me, bro. I ain't gonna lie. That's what I'm saying. That's I, I understand, bro. I understand why the glitch bills need to go because you don't want this to happen. You know what I'm saying? Builds like this should not exist. You should not be as fast as I am at my height. I understand now, fellas. You know what? I'm not even mad. I'm not even mad no more. Y'all don't want metric builds in the game. So be it. it. It is what it is, fellas. You know what I'm saying? But hey, once you decide that you guys don't want to have fun anymore, you guys decided that you don't want to have fun. Look at that. Three. Didn't even need to try, bro. Why? Just why did it? And that shit went in. Now, nah, don't even blame me on that. That's the game. That's the game. How you can you just white like that and just goes in. Look at it. I'm guarding him again. You see, he he's not going in the paint. That's an easy block. And I'm sticking with him on the perimeter. It doesn't mean anything. Look at it. Okay, he gonna pull up right there. He gonna make. I bet. 15-9. <sighs> Y'all think this is fair? Honestly, like I said, I'm not mad. I'm not mad because I know it's some. It's some type of not fair to it, you know what I'm saying? It's not fair at all. But just to be 6'9", and it's a fun build to make, bro. And I feel like everybody needs... If everybody played on a build like this, y'all will understand. Look, at another red. Another red. I just couldn't get the rebound that time because it went straight down. Look at this old head. He bringing the ball off the court. He about to, he about to get ripped. Look at him. I'm in the paint. Look at... I'm literally in the paint waiting for the ball. Give me the ball. Ugh. Knock down green. Oh, yeah. And he could pull from deep. Man, 2K23, I understand, bro. Y'all don't want to build like this, it's fine. But y'all gonna wish you tried it before it's gone. I'm out, fellas. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, bro. Like, like I said, bro, y'all gonna wish that you had played with this build. Y'all gonna wish you had played with this build. I ain't gonna lie. Look at these stats. And it's not even 99 overall yet. It's pretty good after what the height and the weight is. It's 190, bro. 190 at 6'9. 190? 190? Really? That's a guard weight, ain't it? 190 at 6'9? <laughs> fellas. <laughs> it is what it is at the end of the day, fellas. Alright. 2K23 is going to be a good game, I'm pretty sure. You know what I'm saying? If the glitch build's gone, so what, bro? But anyway, I'm out, fellas. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. And then until my next time, until next time. I'm out. I'm bad at intros. Bye.